This is a Rich Lux exclusive. Introducing the Dragon Beauty Face Palette. As a makeup lover, I have to say, this is by far the most gorgeous palette and packaging I've ever witnessed. Maybe it's because it has my fucking face on it. Maybe it's because I made it, but bitch, honey, you can't tell me otherwise. Oh my God, this is so gorgeous. So this is literally me sleeping with the Jason animation on the outside, just like my trailer. But this is the secondary packaging that it arrives in and actually this is 100% recyclable and was less waste in terms of the outer packaging it actually is three dimensional it was really hard to get this kind of like effect but i was so sure in wanting to look like i was enveloped in plastic everything that i am sleeping and also if you flip it upside down it's the same shape of my dragon beauty egg it's just a little touch that I added, but you guys, this is truly so stunning. I can't even express how different and crazy this is. I've been having this on my makeup desk and people will just come and touch it and just be like, whoa, what is that? Like, it just is beautiful. Like, I can't describe it in any other way. Like, I'm so obsessed with how everything came out. Okay, guys, let us know what you think about the Nikita Dragon <laughs> girl. It's a palette. Oh my god. Let me know what you think about the palette. And uh, maybe someone might win one in the giveaway. Who knows? Leave a comment down below. Side of the face palette, it comes with two dust covers. One on the palette itself and then one on the actual mirror, which let me try to get off. Which I think is really important. And this mirror, you guys, I have a giant ass face. And my entire face can fit in here. I actually really love this mirror because my face is literally shaped like this. And it's kind of shaped like a face, you know what I mean? Getting into the actual shades within the palette, I'm obsessed with transformation, catfishing, being the architect of your own beauty, and creating whatever you want. And these are the shades that I use every single day in my routine to create that Nikita Dragon fantasy that you guys see every single day on Instagram or whatever. This is just my go-to. I can pack this one palette and know that I'm going to be set for like the entire trip. So the biggest thing with the face palette that I want to stress from the jump is that you really have to keep your mind open into doing different things. Obviously, duh, these are two contour shades, two blushes, and two highlighters, but I literally use these shades all over my face and I just kind of mix and play and do so many different things with this one single palette that I think will blow your mind. I will be doing a deep dive YouTube video, swatching, demoing, and really going into each of the shade names because I think it's really important, the overall. This is literally a dream come true for my extra ass. I envision this PR box for ever and just drawing it and just thinking about wanting to put a fucking wig in here and wig hair. But this is how the um, PR boxes will look. It's actually not too different from how the boxes for when you purchase look, to be honest. Um, the only difference is obviously it has the hair, but this is just kind of what the PR people will be receiving. Actually, what's cool about this is obviously, yes, there is all this hair and all this Nikita-ness up in here, which by the way, does smell like me. But at the bottom of the box is the face palette. This is the animation by Jason and it is so incredible just to see, like I'm obsessed with the box. How can someone be obsessed with the box but I'm obsessed with this motherfucking box? And obviously it says Dragon Beauty on the top. Hi, it's a little dirty because I have so much foundation on my fingers but anyways, hi. <laughs> the face palette is available on dragonbeauty.com on October 7th. Stay tuned for a bunch more. I still have my campaign images, my campaign video. But I just wanted to give you guys a preview pretty much of the palette and introduce you to DB2 category is face. I'm so excited about this, you guys. Ah! <laughs> Okay, well, first of all, congratulations to Nikita Dragon and uh, for coming out with the palette. You know, I'm pretty sure it's hard. It's a lot of money. So in this clip right here, I'm showing you she's dancing and twerking because she's really excited because she's going to talk to us about the journey and her making this palette and she's just being uh, goofy and crazy. And so, yeah. All right. So first of all, I personally wouldn't call it a like a, like an eyeshadow palette. I think a lot of people are 
were saying it was an eyeshadow palette. But in my opinion, from what we just saw, it comes across to me, my conspiracy, my opinion, allegedly, it comes across like a highlight and contour palette because you do have like those uh, contour shades to like chisel the cheekbones and make that slimming face and it also has like the highlight and shimmers on there to brighten certain areas so i think i think it's a it's a highlight and contour palette i wouldn't say it's an eyeshadow palette so here we go yeah good morning dragons wake up to fucking bad bitches it's time to rise and stunt on these basic assholes i am so excited today because i'm unveiling my brand new product from dragon beauty this is the pr package right here as we know, I started off with my Dragon Transformation Kit inside of my egg, and now it's time to unveil my very first palette that I've ever created. Um, I am just beyond, like, I can't even believe that it's finally time. It takes so long to create these things, and I'm just so excited about the end result of the product because I truly feel like it's just so unique it's so different it's so me and with all of my products i want them to be fucking bomb as fuck and i'm not gonna cut any corners honey uh it took a little time because we got to get some safety checks we got to make sure everything is cruelty vegan and um just bomb you know what i mean so i am so excited to show you guys everything in here i just realized i wasn't using my cunty voice on my stories you know anytime i get really comfortable i use my real voice not that this is not my real voice but like you know, I just need to go, hi, I love it. <clears throat> Anyways, the following is rated TVMA, TSPS, mature audiences, trans, pussy stunting. Viewer discretion is mugging advised. Also, did you like that intro? I have no ass to be fucking shaking and literally nothing is moving but my imagination. But bitch, you can't blame a girl for fucking trying. Around town, bring it around. Okay, so then Nikita Dragon shows us her very first promotional ad for her brand, which a lot of people said it was kind of controversial, how it looked like something from an exotic website and stuff like that. And so it's very that, but you can see like the skin looks very glossy on the face and the body. It's very much like the, the face of the palette so that carried over. But she was just, I guess, showing off like, hey, this is my first ad just to like, I guess, show it to us. All right, Dragons, it is officially time. I just posted the campaign trailer of DB2. I'm dying! If you're from the Dragon Story family, let's comment this secret emoji. And by the way, these are the two previous Dragon giveaway winners. Oh my god, I love you guys so much. I'm literally freaking the fuck out. Oh my god! Okay, so when I first saw this, I was like, what, what's going on? It looks kind of creepy, but then I was like, what? How is this a palette? And it wasn't until she opened it up that I was like, oh, okay, now I get it. Which it looks like you took a lot of time to make this right. Introducing the Dragon Beauty Face Palette. As a makeup lover, I have to say, this is by far the most gorgeous palette and packaging I've ever witnessed. Maybe it's because it has my fucking face on it. Maybe it's because I made it, but bitch, honey, you can't tell me otherwise. Oh my God, this is so gorgeous. So this is literally me sleeping with the Jason animation on the outside, just like my trailer but this is the secondary packaging that it arrives in. And actually this is 100% recyclable and was less waste in terms of the outer packaging. It actually is three dimensional. It was really hard to get this kind of like effect, but I was so sure in wanting to look like I was enveloped in plastic. Everything that I am, sleeping. And also if you flip it upside down, it's the same shape of my Dragon Beauty egg. It's just a little touch that I added, but you guys, this is truly so stunning. I can't even express how different and crazy this is. I've been having this on my makeup desk and people will just come and touch it and just be like, whoa, what is that? Like, it just is beautiful. Like, I can't describe it in any other way. Like, I'm so obsessed with how everything came out. So this is why I said it looked like a highlight and contour palette and not so much an eyeshadow palette. I think for an eyeshadow palette, we would have seen like maybe blues and pinks and whites and blacks. And to me, this truly comes across as like a, like a highlight and contour palette. This is the 
inside of the face palette. It comes with two dust covers, one on the palette itself and then one on the actual mirror, which let me try to get off, which I think is really important. And this mirror, you guys, I have a giant ass fucking face and my entire face can fit in here. I actually really love this mirror because my face is literally shaped like this and it's kind of shaped like a face, you know what I mean? Getting into the actual shades within the palette, I'm obsessed with transformation, catfishing, being the architect of your own beauty and creating whatever you want. And these are the shades that I use every single day in my routine to create that Nikita Dragon fantasy that you guys see every single day on Instagram or whatever. This is just my go-to. I can pack this one palette and know that I'm gonna be set for like the entire trip. So the biggest thing with the face palette that I want to stress from the jump is that you really have to keep your mind open into doing different things. Obviously, duh, these are two contour shades, two blushes, and two highlighters, but I literally use these shades all over my face and I just kind of mix and play and do so many different things with this one single palette that I think will blow your mind. I will be doing a deep dive YouTube video swatching demoing and really going into each of the shade names because i think it's really important the overall shades and so that was the reveal of the nikita dragon palette let me know what you think if you guys like it what are your thoughts on it do you hate it do you like it does it look like something else do we need this on the market again on her post she did emphasize that she's very happy this is she was able to come out with this palette and her being trans and the ceo it is a celebration with its own right so let me know what you think about all that and we'll talk about it in the comments and like the video. Let's try to get this to 10,000 likes. Let's try. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye. I love you so much.